Alright y'all, welcome back. It's Big Al once again. Uh, if you've been watching my channel for a while, you know every once in a while I like to feature a lock like this. Uh, either a deadbolt like this or the locking door handle, whatever it may be. Uh, they're, I feel they're important because, uh, let's face it, these things are on like every front door, okay? I think we've all got some, something like this on our front door. Um, I would like to point out, while I'm not a locksmith, uh, I would like to point out a couple upsides and downsides that, that I'm aware of, and I think you should be too. Um, this one right here is a double cylinder deadbolt, meaning you have to have a key to open it from either side. The outside or the inside, you have to have the key to work this lock. Um, the upside, I think, is pretty obvious because when this lock is locked, all right, there's no jimmy in it open there's no uh you, you can't go through the side of the door and and, and push push this uh, locking pole back it's not going to happen um and uh i seen something recently on i think it was on twitter somebody was showing it off they got that tool that goes underneath the door and up it's kind of like a long wire type deal you go up underneath the door and you and you go through the back and you and you turn the little thumb turn deal and you get the door open it's not going to happen when this thing's locked it's locked you got to have the key or you need to, to pick the lock, drill it out, or something. When it's locked, it's locked. On that same note, when it's locked, it's locked. If you're in bed and the smoke alarm goes off and you haul butt to the front door, you better know where your key is at, or you're going to have some issues. Uh, if you need to get out real quick and in a hurry, uh, that may cause an issue. So just think about you know where it's going to go and uh, keep that kind of stuff in mind, because uh, like I said, I think it's kind of important. So I figured we'd have a little fun with this one, and I'm just going to see, um, I'm only going to use the tools that I carry every day in my pocket, my EDC set, uh, my everyday carry. I'm just going to use what's in here and uh, see what it takes to get into this thing. So I'll grab a tension tool here. We'll grab a rake and a pick. So first thing we'll try is the, is the quicker way. I think I showed, there's the key. Not the greatest bidding. Uh, the cuts on the keys are kind of flat. Um, lock does work like new because it is. There it is locked. So obviously the quickest way would be raking it. So we'll just try this. I think it's a triple peak uh, rake. Put a little bit of tension on the lock. And see if we can... Using one of these, it, it's it's a, a tiny bit of skill and a whole lot of luck, really. Because you're just, you're just trying to kind of lock the lock open. Give it a little rakey rake. And see if we can get it. Oh, there it goes. Just like that. So, again, it's just it's a lot of luck with a tool like this. So let's say the rake didn't work. Let's say the lock's a little better than that and it didn't work. We'll lock it back up. Like so. And we'll single pin pick it. Meaning one pin at a time. And we'll see what it takes. Uh, the Peterson gem. And we'll see what it takes. Let's see. I think I overset that. Let's go for a binder. There we go. Two, three, four. Four. Oh, I overset it. Four. Four, three, and one. Five. Four, three, there we go, like that. 
So not the toughest lock to pick. But again, when you're picking something like this out for your for your front door or back door, whatever, um, just keep those kind of things in mind. Um, what doors are going to go on? Are you going to need to get out real quick and in a hurry? Um, will you know where your keys are at? Uh, those things are kind of important, I think. So, uh, that's it. I just wanted to point that out. Uh, this was the gatehouse, um, I picked up from my local Lowe's. Uh, my Lowe's is kind of like Home Depot, but not. Um, and this is the double cylinder deadbolt. All right. So you're going to need the key getting in and the key to get out. All right. Thank you all so much for watching. I appreciate it. If you're not subscribed yet, please do so. And, uh, if you liked the video, hit that like button. All right. Thank you so much.